Hello everybody, Retrobeard here. How are you all doing on this awesome Friday afternoon? Um, before I get started, I want to say if you do enjoy my content, please remember to like, subscribe, share, click the notification bell, leave me a comment, it's much appreciated. I'm on that lovely push to 1,000 subs. So, um, as you can see and no doubt know from my description, the Super Console X is back in business. Um, I will discuss this more as people come into the stream. Um, it's not a complete return. It's step one in a fashion to get this console to a better state than it's ever been before. Um, it might take a week. It might take a month, but it doesn't take much more than that. So I don't have it as it was before because I'm taking a few steps back and it'll take many, many more forwards. So it'll make more sense as we go along. Essentially, I haven't just temporarily fixed it like before and bunged in 40 odd thousand games. I've only got a few thousand games on very few platforms because I'm doing a very controlled method and I'm ironing out the book so that when it's all matured and I then back up everything, um, it will be an enduring thing and if ever there was a problem it would be a, a 10 minute fix versus a humongous amount of downtime in, pro in a project because I don't have that kind of free time to devote myself to maintaining a 40 pound console from China. I'd rather just have quick fix methods and um, the backbone of my um, support and knowledge has been Dark End Track so if you appreciate this please give him some love and um, go over to his channel and check him out and watch his videos he's an awesome chap he knows just about everything about everything he's got the the ultimate like game room and um, tons of great videos and um, I'd love to see his channel succeed he's a great guy very helpful and kind I wouldn't be here if it weren't for him doing this and um, although this is a modest return to the Super Console X at least I'm here and, and it's back um, what I'm going to be doing is to, in a nutshell, is I'm going to be having the games actually on an external HD, external hard drive. And I'm going to have absolutely loads of games. Um, I don't know how many, but tens of thousands of games, including a vast amount of PlayStation 1 games, DS games, PSP games, anything that I can get to work. That will be a little bit of testing. I know some people enjoy watching me tweak and test games and add things and take things away. Well, I don't. I won't be doing it in the old fashion. I won't be using the ROM sets that came with this initially. I'll be using what um, Dark describes as unified um, ROM sets, where they're beautiful, perfect working ROMs, all in the correct language and stuff format. But where I'll have the trial and error will be when I add games outside of the ROM sets. I'm going to be having a minimum of 500 gig of storage, so this is going to be the super, super console X. And won't have crap it'll just have good working games that need very little tuning perhaps i might have a, sc a scan line here and there and a sharp you know a sharpen in here and there but more or less it'll all be perfect and only be the odd bit of work so it's going to be awesome and then, then when it's all backed up and done properly if i have a problem it'll be 10 15 minutes and i'm back in business exactly as i was so it's going to be living the dream this this um format i'm on now it's only step one i've not even got the external hard drive hooked up yet this is just 32 gig sd card with some master system nes games game boy color and game boy games bunged on just to give me some material these are temporary these aren't even the final rom sets i'll be using so this is just to sort of celebrate that hey we're back we've got the guts of the machine back but it's going to be a work in progress, like I say, for up to a month. And after the month, it'll mostly just be pleasure then, with a little bit of tweaking here and there. So I've not even tested. I've only tested one game, so I don't even know if what I've put on today will work. But we can have a look. It's looking good. But like I say, if this doesn't work, no problem, because it's just, it's a placeholder. Oops. The Master System um, ROM set is the unified ROM set. The rest of them aren't. The rest of the ROM sets I've got on just right now are the the default ones from the um, Super Console X. So this is just a start. And I, even though I, I was tempted to leave it and, um, you know, not do anything until I 
I've got some progress. I thought, well, showing that it's up and working and it's running it is a progress in itself, isn't it? So, hopefully I make sense. But I love this game, so. So, I'm hoping a few people are going to come on today. So we can, um... Talk about it, and I'll, I'll be repeating myself, obviously, to anyone who comes into the stream, but that's alright. I'm used to repeating myself, it's one of my naughty habits. Oh, is the game timed? There's me taking my time, just savouring the game, and it's bloody timed. I suppose I can't see it because of the, um... Live window, sorry. I would love this game on cartridge. I might have to look in, look into it. I mean, it's great on the Game Boy and the NES. I wouldn't mind getting both. Okay, you can't jump like Mario. Have a quick drink, because I am bloody hot. Hot day here in the UK. Oh. Bloody delicious. Hope some people can come in today. Talk. Be nice to give them all. Bloody hell, that was a miracle. Give an update to my, you know. I know, I know plenty of people watch this um, in retrospect. But it's nice to also discuss live, isn't it? If not, it's alright. People have lives. Crap. I've got that Mario muscle memory jumping on people's bloody heads. Now, am I playing a Spanish game? Let's get off it. I know it doesn't matter, but I like to at least have a little bit of a feeling of playing the run. Like I said, I won't be tweaking anything on this because this is a temporary ROM set just to keep me occupied. That's better. We're playing in English. I'm not really good at English, but it's the only language I really speak. I do understand smidgets of um, foreign languages where I can get by to a degree. Well, when I say foreign languages, I mean, I mean uh, Latin languages like Spanish, French, um, Portuguese, Italian. You know, I, I, I've met many people of those um, backgrounds, and I can more or less communicate with them because I know I'll know a language of one of those other ones, and then they'll kind of get what I'm saying. I get what they're saying. But that's just like what I did um, five years of French at school, which was the standard um, standard curriculum. It's nothing special by me. But, and I have an interest as well. Some of it's just common sense. Crap. I see. We need. I see. So when the hit points go down, that's when you. Um, Hi, Miranda Health Bar, that is, um... I've got an angel. I'm not very lucky how this game is, so... No, no, no! What a div. The pressure was there, man. I love this game, it's a shame that I'm sucking. Hey, give him a hammer. Stop, get down, hammer time. Oh, bloody hell. I pressed it too late then. This is where you need, or at least I need, not you, those, that real hardware with the precise timings. So much more forgiving. I bet this falls. Oh no. You naughty game, I want. I'm trying to love you and you're doing that to me. Still like it in proper hardware, so I can um, play it comfortably. Because gaming is harder in streams. People don't get this. They either don't stream or they're so damn good they don't care. But look at this. I 
they could argue this is a bloody remake, couldn't you? But it's got um, a charm to the graphics. I mean, the original's got a charm as well. I wouldn't say this is a huge improvement, it's just... I've got the key! My time is going down, crap! I never got the key. You bugger! This is um quite charming. I don't like the time though, the time going down. I wish I could just take my time with no decreasing health bar, because I'm a sort of relaxed fellow. I don't like being rushed. I'm not built for it. Give me some crap and let's get in the game. Nice and dead theme going on, dude. Oh, yeah. I'm like Mick Dundee now. I loved um, Crocodile Dundee back in the day. There's something magical about the film. I'd like to watch it again and see if it still stands up to the scrutiny, if that makes any sense. Oh, that's great. It's great that it, it's great that I'm not dead, but can I get out? My health's going down. If you don't die, there's no point being able to... You having a laugh? Let me out! What a stupid game. Oh, I did it. Oh, he's my French. How did I get out? Thanks, Doc. I'm gonna have a fit with this, though. I okay, was an exit. I've got a question, actually, my friend. And by the way, welcome to the stream. Um. I, went, I wanted to slam him a load of ROMs, but it says um, in the, um, how do I say this? You know the SD card gets broken down into three areas. Um, the one that's got games, it's only allocated like 1.45 gig to it. Even though it's a 32 gig S SD card. So I can't really, I mean, I know that's not a problem in the long term. And same as the actual other folder, it's only like nine on um, like some tiny amount of memory, so it hasn't really utilized utilized the SD card. That's why it can't update because it's only got a tiny amount of room in both the folders, the Emulec and the um, ROM um, games. It's only used a tiny bit of the SD card, so there's no room to S to upgrade. And I can't. And okay, the the games partition being tiny doesn't matter but it, it's still strange it's only used a tiny bit do you have any understanding why that's the case if that makes any sense i just thought i'd let you know so if i don't i don't get too deep into things before we find out it's wrong or whatever give me the eggs i'm ecstatic yeah. Yeah. Good to be back. These snails don't think so. Oh god. Oh crap, it took two hits. not utilizing the memory card why so it, but it's not left enough room to upgrade the emulec and it's not left enough it made, imagine if somebody wanted to add some games they couldn't even add the snes folder let alone anything else how come my 120 my old 128 gig card 
gave so much more or is it just proportional to the size of the card and it's just something to expect that mate but if you say it's normal then i don't have to worry about it do i i can just understand that soon i'm plugging in my drive it doesn't matter i suppose spam those hammers kid Oh yeah. Oh. That's fine. As long as you realise that probably that's the case, that's the reason why I can't update it, because there's not actually the room to update it in the partition. But if you... So... Oh, so are you going to send me... A newer version or something or, or, it, or will this do me okay thank you Doc. i just wanted to tell you because it's like giving you a, you know a bug, a bug report isn't it in a way it's just giving you oh fair enough so i'll just carry on then okay sorry sorry to bother you with it but uh, you know if you didn't know it might have been helpful no worries and i'm not complaining i just wanted to let you know thank you I just, I just put NES, um, Game Boy, Game Boy Color, and Master System. Thank you. This looks absolutely beautiful. It doesn't even need a scan light filter, it looks so nice just like this. Wish this would come to the switch. Oh man. Ah. Oh thank you, I appreciate that. It's so good to Hello Chris, how you doing my friend? Welcome to the stream. Sadly, we're not ready for Commodore 64 yet. Me, we've got me and Dark have got a lot of work to do. Well, he's doing most of the work. I'm just sort of the, the, the tester. I was busy. I was busy today finally getting this basic um, setup done. It's looking good. We've got a long way to go, but we're going to eventually end up with a Super Console X that's like one of the one of the best ones out there for library and stability and quality. If it works really well, I might end up buying a three terabyte hard drive and just bunging on like most of the PlayStation 1 library on it. One step at a time, I'll use the 500 gig hard drive for now. Hey, this looks so nice, it doesn't even need a scan line filter. Balls. That rock got me. It's good to be back. That's not good though. If I don't have like a memory, I have to just become quicker. It's a massive disadvantage in these games. It's also a limiting factor. Finally. Yes. Move out of the way. Yeah, but none of these upgrades seem to be substantial or meaningful. They just seem to be barely an, in an increment, barely incremental. But, um, I think we're better off maximising what we've already got. That emulates all the 18, 16-bit stuff beautifully, and you know you get your foot in the 32-bit door with the Game Boy Advance and um, PlayStation and and. Um, DS, whatever bit the DS is, and, and the PSP, whatever bit that is, you know, you get your foot in the door with the other stuff, and you're getting your, you're getting your foot in the door with um, Dreamcast.
Yeah. Yeah. Hey, man, has got to make a profit. Oh, God. Bloody hell. Who says the um, NES can't do um, blast processing? Whoa, 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 whoa. Friggin' hell, I was in the Matrix then. Excuse my French there, swearing like a bad boy. I got a bit stressed. Oh, you stinking toad! If I was French, I'd be having frog's legs. Yeah, I think Kim Hank is um, casting as many nets as he can into the pond of life to try and um, catch more fish. If that makes any sense at all. Let's see what the master system's got, or the master system. Yeah, that'll be a nice, um, a nice project, Chris. If you can get the C64 working in style, I'm hoping um, with Dark's um, awesome work, the C64 on here will end up being absolutely crisp, and, and you'll get your C64 fix here as well. If it's no trouble and it just loads up and plays, I'll happily put it on. I'll do entire streams of C64 if it makes you happy. It doesn't give me a nervous breakdown. I love this idea of having a, a massive amount of games all streamlined and working beautifully. God, I wish I had a paddle. Whew. This is hard work. And I can't see what the hell I'm doing with the overlay. Oh, man. Let me see it. Oh. I thought it'd be such a great idea to have an overlay back in the day. I didn't realise I'd be blinding myself in half the games. I am not putting my name in. Name of shame. <laughs> That's true, Chris. Well, with, um, with what Dark was talking about, um... We should have games working fast, um, playing and looking good, and yeah, we won't have the entire library, but we'll have enough to really give it um, a good representation. So we'll bypass a lot of those problems. We'll have no, we'll have no um, fat on here. It'll all just be premium stuff working well. It's not going to happen overnight, but if I'm turning up each day and streaming, then it's progressed. Progressive, isn't it? You know. And I'm also going to find my own quality ROMs to also add. So if there's something that's not on the set, I'll find one that's good. And then um, add them as well. Like some of my favourite PlayStation games and stuff. Oh god, I'm not playing this. This is an insult to Bubble Bubble. Let's try this one. I, I love Bubble Bobble and I want it to look proper. Is this the original? It's looking good. Apart from it's not in English. Oh, it is now. Oh, I love this game. I like playing this on my 4K TV. Oh, and my retro freak. I've got it on cartridge. Probably not much, but it does tidy up things and makes it easy to find games. I suppose any amount of, um, I suppose the more empty a storage unit is, the probably the smoother it runs to a degree. Um, but this isn't this isn't relevant right now because um, what I'm doing right now is just a temporary thing. I won't even have games on the SD card soon. I'll be run, running them off a 500 gig hard drive. This was just to get started today with something to show people. Hello Andy, good to see you, welcome to stream. Hey, t tell the family you're busy like they are when it's, like, when it's football. Get in trouble now. 
I'll tell you how I did it. I had, I had an amazing friend called Dark Entrax who guided me through it. He's like Morpheus and I'm like Neo and he's on the phone telling me what to do. Remember in the Matrix when he's like talking on the phone, Neo, go left, turn right, climb up the stairs. He's like that, guiding me through it. And Dark is like, looks a bit like a white Morpheus. If that makes sense. It doesn't sound racist. I hope he doesn't. Yeah, the technical the technical running of the machine is entirely Dark Entrax's achievement. I've just followed his instructions like a monkey. Um, so I've got some of my own fiddling to do and, and tweaking to do. But without Dark, I would I would I would only be using the previous way of doing it, which I didn't even want to bother with because it was just temporary. Sim and in simple terms, Dark built a custom image with all the firmware and stuff that, that sort of put it back to factory settings and I just installed it on a brand new SD card that's really small, 32 gig, because we're going to be using external hard drives for all the games. And they're going to be those unified ROM sets he was talking about and they're also going to be my own custom ROM sets or anything that's not on the unified ROM set that I want. Is your, is your Super Console Lex working, Andy? If yours is working fine, you're probably fine, you're probably fine with how it is. Mine was just an opportunity because mine was dead. Because my SD card was broken, though we discovered. I'm riding the waves, baby. Yeah, well, first of all, Chris, I'm not the greatest at games, even when I like them. Second, talking and playing is really hard. Third, I'm using a tiny screen on a laptop. Fourth, is input lag, e emulation delay, and last of all, I suck at games. If yours is working fine, Andy, just don't worry about it, just enjoy it. This was just an opportunity because my, my SD card was um, dead. Let's get his redhead. C64 now. You have to run C64 with a steam-powered computer and a, and a cog and a um, crank. Or a calculator for the hardware. Excuses are like arses. We all have them and they all stink. At least, at least I had a good excuse at the end that I suck at games as well. You're just bitter because I can't get the C64 working yet. We have to actually da um, underclock the hardware to work on the C64. I lost because I lost because of hackers. You're hacking me, Captain Silver. There's some crap games on here. Castle of Illusion. Championship hockey, oh god. No pictures. I'll have some scraping to do when I get the final ROM sets on. Chuck Rock. Cloud Master. Cyber Shinobi. Oh. Give that a look. Oh. Yeah, this the, the games I've got on right now, they're just a temporary solution. They're not the um they're not the final um ROM set. They're just something to, to put on here as a placeholder to show that the damn thing's back in action. I'm pretty good at Tetris. Um quite good at Diablo games. Um I'm quite I'm good at Gemfire. Um what else? What else am I quite good at? I'm getting better at Peggle. Yeah, most of the games I've finished um, are JRPGs. I like JRPGs. I don't like streaming with them very much because it's just they just take over my mind and I don't want to talk. All that reading. Oh god, this is a choppy mess. Graphically, it looks it looks like it's sort of trying to get there, but it's so choppy. Wow. 
I completed Super Mario Land on the Game Boy back in the day. Amazing. Why don't you get a genuine C64, Chris, and um, get a RGB SCART for it, and then hook it up to a, to a retro tint and do it properly? This game is appalling. What kind of a ninja fights like that? It looks like me when I was single. Oh. I'm going down. Stop shooting me. Great, you can go off screen. Oh, what an awful game. PC emulation is always the best. Desert Strike on the Master System. I'll be glad to get some proper ROM sets on here, Dark. This, this is just um, I know it. I know it's nice to sort of show proof of concept that the old the old girl's back in action. Oh, don't become the Vice Boy, Chris. Don't be that desperate for Commodore 64. It's just not worth it. Desert Strike. Demastered. Get a C64 Mini. Live the dream. No, this is just a placeholder, Andy. These are used. These aren't proper ROM sets. It's just something to show everyone that it's working. I've only got two thousand games on here, but I'm going to be getting getting this to the state it needs to be in over an amount of time, which depends on how much time I put into it, and also Dark's technical support side, which Dark, you know, he's got his own life and his own projects. He's not beholden to me, so I will gratefully do things on his clock, on his time set, you know. So, I would say the system will start looking really good within a month, that would be my projection, but it could be a, it could be a week, it could be six months, it's, you know, Dark doesn't have to do anything for me, so it's really kind what he's done already. If anybody, any of you guys haven't seen his channel, please go over and have a look, he's got some awesome stuff on there. He's got, like, so many videos. Wow. Okay, I don't have any guns on this thing. Actually, I like the graphics. I don't like controlling the damn thing, though. Bloody hell. This is an airwolf. Oh, there's the guns. Okay. Yeah. Um, the SD gave me about 1.5 gig of room to um, for games, so I just put on the master, a crude Master System ROM set, a crude NES and Game Boy and Game Boy Color. That's all that's on here, and it, it's the very crude ROM sets just to test it. So this is just a proof of concept to say, oh look, it's working. This is nothing um, like the final, you know, um, product. But we, you know, it's nice to. It was nice to be back. I thought people wouldn't mind if I just did something like this, just to. Show the old girl off. Oh, I think they've done it. A full fat desert strike on the mass system. What an amazing system. There's not a lot going on in the world. Crap. 
Is that a GI? Yeah, so this is like the very earliest test version. Get on board, kid. Yay, I've rescued somebody. But yeah, in terms of a basic test, it's nice to see she's working. And that's a start. Great things are to come. Especially when I start getting the DS and, Pl and PlayStation 1 crap on it, it's going to be great. I'm going to try and get a few of the um, Dreamcast JRPs, like JRPGs, like Grandia 2 and Skies of Arcadia, see if they can work. That would be so awesome. I know I can't play JRPGs too much, but just to even a quick go on it. You could do that, but um, external hard drives are much cheaper per gigabyte, aren't they? It's hard to control with finesse. Perhaps it's a better experience on the original Master System controller, but here we are. I used to be quite good at this on the Mega Drive back in the day. Well, I probably wasn't good, but I was capable at it back in the day, but... Crap, not good at it now. Not sure if this is controlling correct. Can't have your cake and eat it, um, Andy. Oh, no missiles left. Ah. I'll be looking forward to using my external hard drive. Whacking on all those games. It's gonna be great. Yeah, with the USB port. Here we go. Something's wrong with that. I can't see on the screen because it's not full screen for some reason. Great game, technical achievement, but bloody annoying to play today. Dr. Robotnik's mean bean machine. Just nice to have your games on your hard drive also because if um Super Console X goes goes dead, you've got your hard drive and all your games. All you're doing is reinstalling the firmware, ten minute job, and then slapping your your, your your external hard drive back in, and you're in business again. Such a sensible way of doing it. I have seen the light. I have seen the light. Hallelujah. New game. I like that. Why would you want to do that for, Andy? Or am I missing the point? It'll be the first time. Um, I'm, not, I'm not very familiar with this game. Oh. I suppose I could try that. Is it like Tetris? No, it's not. Oh, crap. What is it? What are the rows of? Yeah. It's not a great ROM set, though, Dark. It's, um... It's got a lot of Brazil crap and stuff on it. It's not, it's not a great example of a unified ROM set. Unless I'm missing the point on that one as well. Oh, oh, there we go. What the heck? <laughs> what am I doing? You're probably better just sticking with what you've got, Andy. If it ain't broke, don't try and fix it. Oh, 
がすっぽか。No, no, no. Oh, it did break apart. This is game is very usual. Ah, oh, fair enough, Dark. You learn something new every day. Oh man, I'm hungry. What am I doing? What am I doing? Think of the game, not food. Oh, I might have a game on my Switch this weekend, a bit of Final Fantasy VII. Can't beat it. I still say, Dark, you'd be wise doing YouTube videos about all this. You'd get you'd get viewers because there's people here asking you questions and they could be viewers. You could say, watch the video if you want to learn. Your knowledge is of value. I've said this all along, you've got the potential to really have an amazing YouTube channel. Oh, that's fantastic, Dark. I'm learning so much. I'm just glad it went smoothly when I did it all earlier. Oh, balls. Oh, it's alright, no harm done. Well, you've got skills of a rare calibre. I have to get by just with my physical beauty to, to have my channel. Thank God people like Andy and Chris appreciate my beauty so much. Oh, what is that white crap? What is it? Ah, mellow yellow. Oh, Chris. That is, that is um, raw, man. Dark, dark has just has got an exquisite, an exquisite games t taste. That's all. Exotic. Thanks, Dark. I actually was being serious though. That wasn't really. <laughs> If I thought it would get viewers, I'd be like Richard, uh, Rich from um, View Tech USA, and I'd take my shirt off on the stream. But I don't. I'd, I think it would empty the stream out if I took my shirt off, like he does. I think that would push Andy and Chris over the limit. I think Andy's been drinking, just, just bear with him, he's just a bit, he's not making a lot of sense today. Too much good family, healthy good family time is taking its toll on him. No, 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 oh, no. I only play with cucumbers off stream. Huh? Like I say, everything is fine in moderation. Even cucumber time. Here we go. I'm going to try not to buy a Switch game this weekend. My bank is starting to run out of money.
That sounds like fun, Andy. Better you than me. My dad don't do anything with me these days. He's, he's really boring. He's been boring for about 20 odd years now. He does nothing with me. You know what, Dark? Be true to yourself. I only, I only give you suggestions. Because um, I want to see your channel go, but I don't, I'm not trying to tell you what to do, but... Um, yeah, you're probably right. I've been eyeing up a few games. Um, this, ga this RPG world-building game called Cafe or something. Something Cafe. And um, Final Fantasy... Um, what is it? 11 or whatever it is. The the um, Zodiac edition's been tempting me. Legend of Man has been tempting me. Secret of Mana Collection's been tempting me. Um, the, the other Mana game, that's the Secret of Mana 3 that's been remastered, that's tempting me. Bloody Saga Collection. There's so many games. It's, it's, the Switch is just like evil. All oh, data, I think. Yeah, the Switch is evil. I need I need to get some serious dollar on that machine is so good. What am I doing? If you like JRPGs, the Switch will bankrupt you. Yeah, I probably shouldn't though. Like I said before, I've got um, I'm in a bad, I'm in bad paid jobs. I'm not a, a career man. Yes, East, East has been tempting me, but I'm not such a massive fan of that series. I've had some bad experiences with it. Oh, bloody hell. I'm losing. He's losing. There's other games as well. They're all in my blooming wish list, so I don't have to remember them. Yeah. Um, what was the other one I was looking at? The Saga Collection, Final Fantasy Legend. They've got that digital fourteen ninety nine. I mean, I've got them on Game Boy cartridge, which I use a translation patch on them on my Retro Free. But still, to own them on a modern platform is delicious. Oh, what the hell are you doing to me, game? What are you twit? Let's finish on some. No, not finish, but not finish is the wrong word. But let's put some Tetris on. What are we on? The master system. I want to put some Tetris on. Did I put Tetris on here? Oh, I also want... Speaking of that, I also want Diablo 3 on Switch. And I also want Diablo 2 remastered when it comes. I love Diablo. Having Diablo 3 on the go. Oh my god, when I go on holiday this year, it's going to be great. Oh, hello, YT Monster Suenter99. Welcome. You can see this. If you can't see this, just ignore me. But I suppose you don't need to if you can't see this. There's Tetris. The killer rap of the Game Boy. Okay. That screen is too small for my old eyes. Thank you. It don't sound very legit to me. One minute I have 900 subs, the next minute I have 880. I think people are just trolling me. I can't play on that though. Let's get the screen bigger. I'm at the point now where I think my channel has just achieved its potential and this is it. Got to be grateful though, haven't I? What was it? Diablo 3 costs a bloody fortune on the Switch. What was the what was the game ratio to make it um bigger? Can't bloody remember. You know this, don't you, Dark? Help me, Dark Entrax Kenobi, you're my only hope. What was the game ratio? Oh, 
I'm, I'm getting quantity and quality, Andy. The Switch is the um, is an epic machine. I just need about a grand to buy the games I want. Maybe the bank manager can lend me an interest-free loan. Ten nine, thank you. Sorry to keep asking you questions. One day you can ask me questions and I'll and I'll answer it. Okay, where's ten nine? Houston, we might have a problem. Hey, I've got a load of trolls already. I don't need any more. Some people call them trolls. I call them my loyal viewers. Okay, there isn't a ten nine. Some things never change, do they, on this bloody machine? See if that makes it all right. That'll do, donkey. You are always trolling me. Look at this. If anybody tells me they don't like Tetris, I would not trust them. Do you like Tetris, Chris? You still here? It's a pre a pre um planned answer, it's yes, you do like it. This, and bear in mind, this isn't a unified ROM set either. This is the crappy Super Console X ROM set. Oh wow, your life was empty before you found this stream. That's amazing, Andy. I'm glad I brought fulfillment to your life and enrichment. I've, I've brought that. I've, I've saved your marriage, reunited you with your family, got you closer to your children. Everything's being made right. Your career's gone up. You and your dad are doing great DIY jobs together. All is well. Oh crap, what am I doing? One day I'll learn to read and game and it'll be a great moment. In fact, learning to game at all would be an achievement, I suppose. Oh, what the heck? Let's go down the wrong way. I can take it. I am all crapper. And you're like Megan Markle. Boom, boom, shh. Control pads ever so sensitive. Parts keep zooming down, or parts, shapes, whatever they are, pieces. Oh, I might have to get this on the 3DS. The 3DS, the original DS, now the Switch. They're Nintendo handhelds, which have made me very happy, but also very. Let's just say spend, spending too much of my limited disposable income. Thank God they all go up in value, so if I ever regret it, money in the bank. It's the only reason why my missus never says anything, so I think she actually thinks, well, at least they're going up in value. I'm glad I've changed so many people's lives. And by the way, I didn't, I didn't, I don't think Chris said anything, but still, it's still good that you've involved him. I think he's on his Commodore 64, winding it up to work. It has a crank on it, you have to power it. Welcome to the Commodore 64! 
the most powerful system of 1981. I don't know why I have to speak in that voice for when you use it, but oh god, what am I doing? I'm even going wrong on this game on the stream, that's why I know I can't game on the stream, because I'm actually alright at this game. Does it make you feel better about your own gaming skills, Dark? Is it like an ego boost? I promise when I play on my own on the TV, I'm a lot better. No one's gonna believe me. I think this controller is out of calibration or something, unless I've been spoiled using the Xbox one. Yeah. I think the C64 is the Emperor Palpatine from Star Wars, and the Sinclair Spectrum is Mace Windu. The C64 is trying to shoot lightning at the um, Spectrum, saying, I'm getting so weak! And the C64 has got, um, the Spectrum's got its lightsaber blasting the lightning back using his, the force power Mace Windu has. I assume the, Am the, the Amstrad CPC is Anakin Skywalker, betraying Mason, cutting his hand off, of course. This party's over, Chancellor. That's awesome, Dark. I look forward to seeing that. That's going to be brilliant. You've got the skills, the knowledge. People will love that. And your fan base will start growing, as it deserves to. Oh, there's not a bloody lot here to do, is there? I love the Nintendo DS. I wasn't going to ask. I look, the Nintendo DS is probably my favourite handheld of all time, but the Switch is starting to catch up. The 3DS is just that solid, like, second place machine. I do love the 3DS. If I never had such a nice lady, I think I'd marry the 3DS, but no, she's lovely, so I'll keep her. A shame, where were you? Work on by. Yeah, baby. Some very organised dark, dark. You've got a bit of that OCD going on, haven't you? I'm not organised, I'm random. Actually, you know what I'm going to do when I get this set up? I'm going to get some mega CD games on here, like um, Snatcher. I bloody love Snatcher back in the day. I bet you know that game. That was such a good game. Oh, bloody hell. Twit. Tetris is absolutely beautiful on here. I know I'm butchering the gameplay, but you know, I am trying to be quick about it to keep it exciting. I'm impressed. Wow. Dark. Having the mega C having the Mega C D, playing some of the classics like Shining Force C D, Snatcher, 
uh, Sonic CD, uh, what else is there? Anything else CD I can think of? Silk Heed, whatever it's called, that was quite good. Lunar, both Lunar games, they were great JRPGs, and what the hell have I done to this game? Oh, you idiot! I'm sorry, I mean me, not you. Well, that's me screwed. Yeah. I'm gonna get the very best of the Se Mega Se and Sega CD, you know, the best of my taste. If you, you know, if there's the ROM set, I'll just whack that on there. Let's just get myself out of this mess. Yeah, I had some great memories in the Mega CD back in the day. Happy days. Lethal Enforcers. Quite enjoyed that back in the day. Yeah. Yeah, there's a few so there was a there's a few JRPGs and gauntlet style games and things, weren't there? And Dune. You're gonna check him out. Just enjoy his channel, mate. You ain't gonna check him out. He's a handsome fellow, but you know, he needs your viewership, not your admiration. Gotta be careful, Dark on here. There's a lot of stalkers. Heimdall, I've not tried that one. I have to try Heimdall, I'll have to try that one. Oh, I've recovered from my stupid mistakes, that's good. I can't believe how nice the graphics look. Oh, of course I'm doing 1080p 60, aren't I? So it's 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 like a whole new visual fidelity. That's what it is. You the man. What am I doing? Oh no 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 no! Oh, crap! The beginning of the end. Maybe I can slip. No, I can't. Oh oh oh! Oh bugger! Oh, the, it's looking up. The stream's nearly finished. I can afford to die now. Oh crap. I tell you, I've got to get used to this control pad again. It doesn't feel nowhere near as nice as my Xbox one. Shame I can't hook an Xbox one controller on here. Been spoiled. Spoiled, you have been? Yes! <laughs> oh, bollocks. No, Yoda wouldn't say that, would he? Stupid fat habit. Please try again. No, I'd rather not. I don't want a meltdown. Well, Doc, we can safely say the system works stably and well. So we've got the um the improvements of the actual image to come along and we've got the ROMs and then we'll be there. I'll get the I'll get the um the external hard drive ready over the weekend. I'll let you know when it's done. I'll follow your instructions. Thank you. My voice acting's amazing, isn't it? I'll let you know when it's done and it shouldn't take me long. It's not a complicated process, is it? And then we'll have I should have five hundred gig of storage available. Hope that's enough. Eventually, if it works out well, I'll upgrade to several terabytes, but I wanted just to start with 500 gig. Thank you, Andy. Thank you for coming along, even though you're busy with your family. You are a legend. You're all legends. I'm very happy to be back, and the system looks absolutely crisp. That 1080p 60 is showing. Thank you, Dark. That will be awesome. And I'll get that hard drive and all the games on looking good, working well, or as many games as I can fit. Which 500 gig of um, retro gaming storage is pretty immense from where I come from. And then we'll have, um, we will have the beginning of the new beginning. Wait, no, you know what I mean. We'll have the new start and the improvements. And if anybody wants to improve their Super Console X. They can always just add a hard drive themselves. They don't need to do all the other stuff, do they? They can just add a hard drive, really. So, I hope everybody has a great weekend. I'm not going to be streaming tomorrow. Obviously, I don't do Saturdays, so 
I'll see you all Sunday, usual time. Hopefully, I made a bit of progress by then. No promises, of course. Well, depends on me and Dark and life and what goes on and what goes right and all that. So, everybody's an awesome night. I'm going to have some nice chicken and chips, I think, tonight with some. Yeah, that dodgy SD can, can do one. I'm going to chuck that away in the bin. Um, yeah, so, um, if, of course, if you do enjoy my content, please remember to like, subscribe, share, click the notification bell, leave me a comment. If you know anyone, your friends and family or acquaintances who might like my channel, please send them my way. And please, if everybody gets any time, going to check out Dark Entrax's channel. It's absolutely awesome and packed with content. Show him some love because... He's um, the only reason the Super Console X is back, I won't lie. So take care of yourselves, everybody. I'm going to go. This is Retro Beard signing off. All the best. See you all Sunday if you can make it. Bye for now. Thanks a lot.